I know, it's been a hot minute since I filmed a weekly vlog, but I'm back and we're filming them, okay? So, um, hi, it's Monday. I think it's about five o'clock in the evening. You know that I never ever film vlogs, like, first thing. I look shit. Right, I need to start taking pride in myself. Do you know like when you follow boys and, you know, they look fit and you think, oh my god, if they come on my YouTube and see how much of a catfish I am, like, they're gonna be like, oh my god, no. So, I've gotta take pride for the boys. You just never know who's watching you. But for the start of the video, you know, if you watch it, I know you won't make it the whole way through because I'm boring, but you know. Hi. I I'm waffling now. I'm waffling. Right, just shut up, Louise. Anyway, hi. Um, so, weekly vlogs are a video that I get requested all the time. I really don't know why you all like them. Because I, I find myself really boring. I'm not going to lie. But you do. So here I am to give you a weekly vlog. This could end up being a really bad vlog and I'll end up forgetting to film. Oh my god, yeah, look at this, right? Let's start the video off with this. <laughs> This is the second time it's happened. The universe is shouting out, Lucy, do a declutter. And I know I need to, I know, I need to clear out because this is ridiculous. I tried to hang up one dress and it's went, and I think it's, yeah, it snapped the actual thing, which I'm fuming about. Like, I'm really angry at myself. I've let it get like that again. Um, I do desperately need to clear out. Oh my God, how much am I waffling? Do you want to know why? Because I've had two coffees. I've just finished my second coffee of the day and I literally... I know for a fact if this is on the TV and someone's mum and dad are listening to this, they'll be like, get her off. She's well annoying. Because <laughs> my mum's like that. When someone's talking too fast, she's like, Lucy, who are you watching? So yeah, I'm sorry, mum and dad. Look at my eyes. I look amber. I don't know why I look so amber. Um, but anyway, right. So, that is a big issue. But let's add to the issue and give you all a haul. I just went live on TikTok. Some of you might have been watching it. Comment if you have. There was so many of you. Um, I go live pretty much every day now. So if you want to see live streams, then head over to TikTok. But I was wearing this hoodie and it's from White Fox. And everyone's like, oh my God, oh my God, that hoodie, I need it. And it's like a mushroom colour. It's so beautiful. You all know the code is Lucy L to get the money off, okay? I'm going to move you all into my room to, to do a little haul and show you what I've got because let's be real this I, I can't move here a few things before I start if you've not seen me do a white fox haul or you've not shopped there before get money off with a code Lucille that's it for starters if you're in the US New Zealand or Australia then there's F to pay for you they do offer express worldwide shipping as well and they also stock white fox swim and white fox active wear um, but we won't be needing any of that soon I mean maybe the active wear because oh, I need a booty yeah, I'm gonna start on this outfit so this is a little crop top that I have actually worn out I wore it the other weekend and it's actually unreal I love it it's Y2K vibes right it's like a lace little top and then we have got a collar, which I'm going to put over it. This is sold separately. So it's like a khaki jacket. So pretty. You can get this skirt, which is the same material, same colour. It basically goes with the jacket, but it's not a collar. It is, but it's sold separately. So you can get the skirt on its own, the jacket on its own, or you can get both. Right, I've just clipped my hair up. It's not looking that great. Um, but you know when your hair's just annoying you when you're like trying to get changed? Um, so I just clipped it up. Oh my God. This top, I love it. I wore it the other day, like I said. It's just so... Nice, fits so well. I'm in love with little crop tops like this. And then um, I pop this skirt on with it to show you. Um, this is the back of it. Oh, I always do that. Literally always, but this is the back. Cute little khaki mini skirt. And it's also got pockets. Look, I love it. And then we've got the jacket to throw on top. I feel like the white top looks so cute underneath this because it's got the white, like white fox embroidery. This jacket. Unreal, like even on its own, like without the skirt, she ignores the skirt, she looks like <gasps> Green is gonna be my colour this autumn, I can feel it. It's just such a beautiful colour for this time of year and I'm obsessed. Look, it goes so well. Is this a fake pocket? <gasps> it's not, it's a real pocket. This one is too. Oh my God, and we've got pockets here. Okay, I love that because sometimes carrying a bag annoys me. So if I can get away with that, carrying, like on a dog walk. I'm not gonna go dog out of the back, okay? So poo bags, headphones, phone, more poo bags. Right, I'm gonna show you this. This is autumn as well. Look, look at this jumper. Autumn vibe. I'm gonna actually keep this skirt on with it. V neck. Oh, I nearly took the lamp out. Stop it. Oh my god, look at this for an outfit. This always happens. Come on. Look at this for an outfit. This is a cute outfit oh my god with like boots cream boots you know that that look good you know that look good i love this as well it's got like 
it like flared sleeves i'm fully obsessed with this i am obsessed this is such a winter vibe i love skirts and boots with jumpers that is like my favorite thing in autumn big jumpers with a little skirt and boots i think that looks so cute they're very y2k again this is so pretty these actually have not come out of fashion at all i remember last autumn these were like a you know a big thing like the double zip jumpers i feel like in autumn time you need basics don't you like you need basic bodysuits to to wear my hair's going crazy she excuse me right i'm a little bit of a mess um but yeah basic bodysuits and oh my god white fox do the best ones i got some last time um like last month we've got a white one right it's like a t-shirt style bodysuit you could only feel this like it's double layered um so thick and soft material i got one in white one in like a nice blue color i think that's so pretty obviously i got one in black because i'm obsessed with black so i'm gonna shove um this on actually yes, yes yes oh my god if you've watched me for quite a while you know that i get so excited over like basic things like these are so basic like they're literally just double layered pretty plain bodysuits i don't have a bra on can't see a thing um i just trust in white fox so much like their clothes are just 10 out of 10 quality everything about them love them i'm gonna show you this whilst i've got this outfit on because girls i'm obsessed look at this oh my god i have wanted a leather jacket um like a new leather jacket for a long time and i think you know what i'm not gonna get one till it's you know autumn winter time always see molly may in like whenever she wears a black leather jacket it's always like quite a, like a baggy one always looks unreal like i need to get one that's that's baggy and not skin tight i feel like they're just putting an outfit together and make an outfit go from like a five to a ten okay i just love them i love them look at the jacket it's just so pretty look amazing with up oh, oh. I always forget about them. <laughs> Literally makes an outfit come together. A leather jacket just does. Um, like I say, I needed one for a long time. And I saw this, I was like, oh my God, I need to get it. And these jackets are unreal quality. Look at it. it kind of looks a bit crazy because it has been sat in the box. But who cares? It's pretty. I feel like the white would look better underneath it. If you're ever contemplating buying anything from White Fox and you look and you're thinking, oh my God, is it gonna be bad quality? Is it gonna be see-through? I can assure you it's not, but I do need to cover. And that's not because of it being see-through, because it's not. It is because it's cold in this room, okay? I do not wanna get any monetized. Look at my hair, what the hell? I think these are a staple because you can accessorize them, you can dress them up, dress them down, do what you want. They remind me of Rachel from Friends, so much you'd wear. Oh my God. I love this jacket. It's just so cute. I just thought I'd show you it with the white underneath so you get the vibe. You know, I feel like the black and the black, black on black, kind of clashing a bit. So I thought, we'll show you it. But with this skirt, it's, uh, it's not making it look like a full outfit. Um, I'm going to try this on, this blue bodysuit, because I love blue. Blue is my favorite color ever. And I know that this out of both of these, I probably wear most. Okay, again, it's cold. So just ignore, right? But again, fashion place they're at my door because these don't really go do they these colors no but we'll just ignore the fact that i got this skirt on i don't actually have any um, bottoms in this haul to pair with this so we'll just deal with it oh my god how beautiful they're just so big ugly like i literally don't have a bra on right now and they just like sit so good on me i can move in them they're stretchy but they're also comfortable thick material soft material they're just basics that you need in the wardrobe so yeah i don't know if they're coming in any other colors but black white blue what more is a girl need oh my god yeah i'm gonna try this on so this set i picked up um a little black set it's got them diamond -y popper things on oh my god obsessed so i've got two dresses in this haul that are the same and they're very similar to this i've tried them on i haven't tried this on oh my god this is unreal i'm obsessed literally i keep saying all the time but the diamond popper thing it's my favorite thing ever and white fox boutique do so many pieces with this detailing on and basically there was a dress on there that couldn't be shipped to the uk and it was so similar to this it was like this at the bottom and it like sort of crisscross and it was long sleeved and i was like oh my god i'm so upset but this is available to ship to the uk so i was like straight away boom. i've got two dresses in here 
very similar. It's got that popper diamante detail. We'll get onto that, don't worry. But this is just something else. I am in love. These are my favourite things that White Fox do. Anything with this detailing, oh, I want it all. Um, so I've got a red dress and a blue dress. And you're probably thinking, Luce, they look so small. They're like one size, but they're so stretchy. They're like shapewear. So which one should I wear first? Mm. Right, this is a dress in blue and oh my god i did say in my tiktok um that i really love this dress and i always wanted a shorter version in blue and here it is white pox you've outdone yourself i just love this brand i feel comfortable in this you know i don't know what it is about white pox every time i order summer it just makes the boobies look good i don't know it's crazy probably have to invest in some like pants that are, is it perspex like clear They've got clear straps on, unless you don't care about, you know, wearing no pants. I do. I get scared. So, um, you definitely need to invest in some of those. So, I'm going to put it on in red now. Oh, my God. If you follow me on TikTok, you will have already seen this. Um, oh, no. My belly piercing. Makes me feel good, right? It just makes me feel good when I wear it. Um, so, yeah, this is it up close. So beautiful. Um, I love the black one that I've got as well, like the, the midi dress. Or is it not dress? No, midi dress. So pretty, got it in brown and blue. I've got this in red. I've, I've got so many different sets and dresses from White Fox that I've got this detail because I'm just obsessed with it. So this is the last outfit I'm gonna show you yeah, because I don't wanna drain you too much. And it's like open at the front there and then all open around the back. Oh my God, oh my God, so pretty. And then look what I got to go with it. Look how beautiful that is. Oh my God. They always do the best bags, White Fox. I just love them. <laughs> I unintentionally saved the best to last. I had no idea how much I was gonna love this. This time of year, right, you can wear, I feel like you can get away with maxi dresses because your whole body's basically covered. You just got like the top bit out or whatever. But maxi dresses, I love them. I feel like they look so flattering on all the time, favorite. What the hell? Like that, <laughs> is it, was it, is it? I can't actually quite understand this. Why have I not worn this before? I don't know. This will be getting worn. I actually want to wear this every day. It's so flattering as well. Like, look at the back. Doing bits here as well. But it gives that illusion again. But what? <laughs> I'm confused. Dot com. I walked it. Anyway. Um, pair it with this bag. Oh my god. It's so classy, this outfit. But then, like, sexy, obviously. What the hell? Um, This doesn't even feel like me right now. I feel like I'm in a dream. Because I'm, I'm really, I feel really good in this. Like really, 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 really good. Wow. Next night out, you know what I'm wearing. Anyway, so yeah. How cute is this outfit? Wow. If you get anything and you're like me, itty bitty community, you, you feel like nothing that you ever wear will, will make you feel confident with these, then do you need this dress? In fact, I actually need a photo in this. I'm going to wait till I actually go out in it. I am freezing. I've just got back into this hoodie. Um, and now I'm currently writing down um sorry one sec. i'm currently writing down um some payments that are due in some overdue is that the right word yeah um outstanding invoices i think so i need to chase them up but um i just need to always write things down always write things i need to do down i also have got <laughs> I'm trying to see how many tower readings i've got which i was going to show you if i'm doing these look at all them ticks they're all the ones I need to do. 18 hours today. So I'm doing those today. Anyway, so this this woman that I'm doing a reading for, I'm doing her a love reading, right? Um, and these are the cards she got. So she got two of wands. Nine of wands, like that, in my opinion. Everyone reads differently. When a card falls out like that, that's somewhat blocking. There's a blockage. Then she got the death card. The Empress, Knight of Wands, Ace of Wands, Lovers, Six of Wands, Temperance, Four of Wands, Page of Wands, and the Wheel. So many wands. So I'm guessing someone must be a fire sign in this reading because what the fuck? I need to film that and send that to her. I need a cup of tea. I feel very tired. Um, but yeah. Blah, 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 blah. This is just me doing the reading. I love doing readings, but they just take up so much time. Oh, nice. So I've just done a reading um, and yeah i already had the cards out for the woman who ordered because it didn't basically send on snapchat so i needed to do it on a google drive link so when i have done a reading with my cards i get my sage 
This cleanses the cards. I used to hate the smell of incense as well. Like I used to be like, oh my God, that actually stinks. And since doing tarot, I've just grown to absolutely love it. Like I really like it. It's um, not something that everyone's gonna like. I actually just grown to like it. Cause I don't know, no bad vibes. Oh my God, look at this for a snack break. Oh, doing my tarot. And I did just some toasted bread, <laughs> some toast. Um, some alioli and some olives. Oh my god. I love uh, alioli and olives. It's my favourite part of food when I'm in Spain. I'm gonna take a photo, that's really cute. You know when you're really, really hungry and you go out, you and the family or whoever you're with, go out for food and they bring over the alioli and the olives at the, at the start. Oh my god. Mm, mm, mm. Also, someone teach me how to pie people on nights out because the amount of times I wake up on a Sunday, it's like midday, right? I get a, a call or a text. Hi Lucy. I'm like, who is this? Like the, the guy you met last night? And I was like, what? Every every weekend without fail it happens. I'm not mean. I mean, I'm not a bad bitch. Some girls could just be like, no, I'm not giving you my number. I'm like, okay. I'm not a bad girl, and I'm not scared of people, but I feel bad. So I just give them it. Then I wake up to like random messages. Like I had to tell someone yesterday that I had kids and I wasn't even out. I was actually at home with my kids um, last night. My I'm gonna tell her, I've been sat, having my snack, chilling out. I give the girl a little rundown, the girl I'm doing this reading for. Give her a little rundown of these cords. Um, she just put, oh my god, I am actually in shock. Literally everything is so true, what you've said in that. That is crazy, wow. Okay, I don't lie. Hi, so I'm a bad vlogger, okay? Um, I just, I'm so bad at the moment with filming, I'm really sorry. Um, I look like shit right now. Um, I know I always say that, but I do. This mirror looks really, honestly, it needs a good clean, look at that. So, I think it's been about a week since I filmed this video. Um, how bad is that? Um, so, what I'm going to do is I'm going to carry on and it's a Sunday today. So, let's do a spend the Sunday with me. Um, what I'm going to do is I'm going to go run a bath whilst I'm getting my room sorted. I've got my bedding to put in the wash because it's actually disgusting. Sort my room out. But let's go run a bath. I've got my bath running. Um, the reason why I'm getting a bath. It's because look at this, okay, I'm a mess right now. I need to do my nails as well. Um, I need to do my tan. It's going to be a pamper Sunday. So it was going to be a weekly vlog. It's turning into like a daily pamper day. I'm going to take my bedding off. This is so overdue. I'm trying not to get my face in this right now because I look super bad. I get a lot of messages from you all. Um, very similar messages like, I love you clean with me. Can you do more clean videos? Like spend the day with me, but like organising um, because I feel like the majority of people like them because it motivates them to do it. Does anyone else just hoard cups in the room? I've got one, two, three, four. Okay girlies, so we've pretty much cleared the room. Now it's time to clean the surfaces. I'm gonna clean just quickly around my windows as well um, whilst I've got the blinds up. This is such a nice smell. It makes the room smell beautiful. Right, onto the mirrored furniture. This is disgusting, it always is. Um, I'm gonna use my spray for this. I always find doing this on a Sunday. I don't know, it just sets me up for the week. Getting a bath, sorting myself out. I've actually stayed in this week and as well, guys. Are you proud of me? Oh my God, what a fucking mess. I'm out of the shower. Well, I'm out of the bath. I've got rid of that awful tan. Um, and I need to re-tan my hands, my arms. Um, oh, oh, oh. Look how healthy I'm being today, guys. Got a vitamin C, I've got a peppermint tea, I've got an orange and I've got a banana. Look how healthy that is. I'm just such a health freak today. Um, I'm trying to get my shit together. Hola. So, I went live and I was chatting that much live that I actually have bit got ready and it's so dark outside so it's like what is even the point like i can't use artificial lighting it just doesn't look great so i'm going to film a youtube video um i'm filming a fake designer jill paul which you'll see on the channel very soon i bought loads of fake designer stuff for summer um and completely forgot to film it so i'm going to film that now because why not um it is a bit out of season but uh, that's fine um and then what i'm going to do is do some readings, which, you know, pointless because I've just literally done myself up. 
Um, yes, that's what I'm going to do right now. I'm making tea for me and mum tonight as well. I'm going to make the Gigi Hadid pasta. Mwah. So I'll do a little cooking show. Should I do that? Yeah, I'm going to do that. Okay, so um, I'm making dinner, tea, whatever. I've got my pasta cooking um, and I'm doing the Gigi Hadid pasta, you know, the vodka without the vodka. It is usually onions, garlic, in oil with tomato puree, cream, all that shit. I am not doing the onions, I cannot be asked for that. I'm, I'm doing minimum effort tonight, you know. Cannot be bothered. Anyway, so, I'm gonna use some light butter. Everyone's got their own way of making this, I've realized. Like when you look at TikToks, everyone does it so differently. I'm gonna put a bit of butter in, a bit, that's quite a lot. Put in some garlic. Um, I'll use my garlic, oh shit. Okay, oh, 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 right, three, we'll do four clubs. Or five, I mean, who cares, yeah, we'll do five. All right, no, they're gonna stink here. Right? The skin off a few of the bulbs. I'm not a chef, okay, this is just easy. As you can see, I've got some gingerbread men and some Jaffa cakes behind me, you probably can't see that. Um, I love Jaffa cakes at the moment, like, literally love them. You know when you get like hyper fixated on a food? That is me with Jeff cakes right now. You don't actually need to peel them. You don't, you don't. Sometimes I don't, sometimes I leave them. I love the smell of garlic. It's starting to smell okay. Unless I'm just getting used to it being weird. I'm just keeping the skin on because we're, we're lazy. We're, we're being lazy today. <sighs> there we go. Get some herb seasoning, which we'll put in soon. I'm gonna mix this around. Oh, garlic butter. Mm -mm -mm. That looks unreal and it smells beautiful. Oh, I stink of garlic. Seriously, I look crazy. I should have tied my hair up, but you know. This is nearly done. Fiesta is nearly done. This is literally so quick though, this meal. Like, it's so easy to make. So quick, minimal effort. Tomato puree in. I used to make this when Love Island was on, like it reminds me of Love Island. Cause I used to make it throughout summer. It was my dish, I used to love it. Okay, we're gonna season it. Okay, now we're gonna put a little bit of pepper in. And voila, that's the pasta done. It looks so good. The camera doesn't do it justice. I'm gonna play it out. Someone needs to wife me. What do you rate it out of 10, mum? It's beautiful. Mm -mm -mm. Oh my god. That pasta was so good. Always have it in my mind. Oh my god, I'm gonna eat healthy. Me, me, me. No, I'm fucking not, okay? I mean, look at this. Look at this. It's just greedy. Today I was like eating a banana on live and I was eating an orange. I was like, this is the start of a new me. Like, I'm just gonna be healthy. Um, no, I'm not. I'm not, and I don't care. Look at this elite, 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 elite snack, snack, gingerbread men. Oh my God, mini gingerbread men. And they're in the Christmas bit, and I actually don't really give a shit about Christmas unless I have a sexy boyfriend, then obviously. But anyway, yeah, so um, I fancy just getting some of these, seeing them. But I love gingerbread men. And this is gonna be a little bit like mm, controversial, but I like gingerbread men with a glass of milk. They're tiny. Got smaller. I just dunk him in and then I eat his legs. No, they're not actually that good. No, I don't know what gingerbread I like and it's not these. It's not these. I know you're gonna be like, oh my god, gingerbread's all the same. No, it's not. Halloween is here, right, obviously. And the, the big like gingerbread cookies that they do like, not the cookies, but like, they, like this, but nicer at the co-op. And it's like, 
It's more of a soggy biscuit. Oh my god, I can't believe I just said that. Do you know what I mean though? And I like that in a biscuit. I'm still scared on that. I'll have one more. What the hell? I swear I've not been crying. I swear. Oh my god, I'm freezing. I'm so cold. But it's snack time again. I don't know. I'm just craving sugar and that gingerbread man. We're not it. I like the men that I go for. I'm like boys, like stupid boys that just are not great. Anyway, we want the men like our Jaffa kicks. Squidgy, soft, but sexy. I've not really done a lot today. Um, I did get a video film though, so I'm gonna edit that tomorrow because I'm so tired. I need to go get a shower. Hey girlies, um, I haven't actually vlogged on this video in literally like a week probably. Shit. Um, anyway, I'm in Manchester on my own. Can you bloody believe it? Uh, look, I'm staying at the Mal Malmaison. Malmaison. Um, yeah, it's so pretty. I've been doing my makeup and I'll give you a little tour. Look, I've got a little cupboard here. I was scared to open this because I thought, what if there's someone in it? Um, but it's okay, there is no that. Oh, shit, 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 shit. Um, and this is the bathroom. How nice is this for some cheeky pics? Not, not like that, just, you know, nice pics for the gram, you know. Oh, pretty. We have an event tonight. Claudia's event, so I thought I'd just... Um, vlog a little bit. I mean, I probably won't bring my camera out, but I'll try and vlog some on my phone. I wish that would stay up. Like that, how do I get it to? Have I done it? <gasps> that could have saved me so much hassle when I was getting ready then. Anyway, we've done it. So yeah, I thought I'd just sit down with you all and do my hair. As you can see, my hair looks like a mermaid the moment um it's so weird coming away on my own but i actually kind of like it i'm not gonna lie i kind of like it um literally all my friends just couldn't make it and i thought oh, i'm missing claudia's events so i'm going um so i'm meeting the bonnie dolly girlies when i get there um and yeah i'll try and film some content it's really really difficult i actually went to an event um it looks to kill and we shop event on when did I go? Literally two days ago. And the same thing, no one would come with me, so I stayed in the hotel on my own again. Maybe this is a new thing for me, I actually kind of love it. Um, just chilling. I ordered some room service, can't even eat them, I feel really sick. But I mean, I have really bad anxiety on the train, but I think that was probably because boys. Um, but I also don't like uh, traveling a lot. Do you know what? Don't mind sitting in a hotel and things like that, but when I travel on a train on my own, I don't know what it is, it just really, really gives me anxiety. So what I'm doing, I thought I'd just film some up because this vlog's probably been really boring. It's probably me cleaning my room like I do in every vlog. <laughs> and that's just annoying. That's not what you want to see, do you know what I mean? So I thought, um, let's do a little get ready. Well, not get ready with me, I did just get ready, but I had to rush it, literally. How is it now? Go on. Show me. Hey Siri. What time is it? Answer. It's 7.24 p.m. Yeah, it started at 7. The event started at 7. Hopefully I'll get there for 8. Um, hopefully the girls want to go out, out after because it's Friday night. Friday night. Do you know what I always find as well with with you really should have it. Oh shit. With events, they never ever land on a weekend. Like it's always midweek. So Claudia's is is a weekend. It's Friday. Funky Friday. So no, go in Manchester. I'll show you what I'm wearing as well when I get changed, but it's it's that black midi, midi dress, maxi dress. You might see it on my Instagram if you follow me. It makes the boobs look super good. I haven't even got time to like get, set up a tripod and take photos of myself um, because I literally need to, to, to be, be there. But yeah, the reason I'm so late is because obviously nobody was coming with me and I didn't want to miss out. So I was like asking around everyone like, are you going tonight, are you going tonight? And then obviously I found the girls that are going. So I booked the same hotel last minute as them. 
um, so we can get taxi back together. But yeah, I don't know really what to talk about. Um, obviously this is not like a proper get ready murder part film, but um, my driving, should we talk about that? My test was originally on the 14th of October, Friday the 14th, but and my driver looked at me, I looked at him and he was like, are you ready? I was like, mm, no, I, was, I, don't, I just didn't feel ready. So anyway, um, I think he knew that I wasn't. I was still kind of struggling with little things, not loads, like I can drive fine, but like just little things I need to work on before. Um, so I've got it booked in for the start of November. <laughs> That's all I'm giving you, honey. Oh my God. It's at 11.11 11 as well. Is that the angel? I was like, no, no, no. This is the right, this is the right slot for you. I'm wearing like a black dress with gold heels and like a little white fox bag. Um, oh, I'm wearing a dress that I actually put in this video before. See, I'm wearing the white fox outfit. Actually, I didn't realise. Look at this big bottle of water. God knows how much it's still going to be. But it's like 100 quid. Couldn't even find the, the room service, so I just rang up and was like can i get chips wine and water i don't have to go for a red lip i'll just this i mean this is trusty like it's trusty it's not gonna cut all of my teeth we'll go with the flow i fell in love with an emo girl do you ever talk to a new boy and you like you don't want to jinx it so you just don't tell anyone every time i speak to a lad i tell everyone i tell everyone every man and his dog and his, his auntie and his nana and so i need to stop doing that i really do because it jinxes it and then everyone's like, oh, so how's, how's things with so-and-so? Mm, yeah, you don't even like me. Um, does anyone else do that? Get so excited and then the boy lets you down. So you got to stop doing that. Do you know what? Why do I say it like that? I've noticed lately I say no, like, nay, nay. Do you know what? Do you know what? There we go. Do you know what, right? Um... I'm gonna say again. Oh shit. All I want is an emo girl. I just didn't want to cut this vlog short. I didn't want to cut it like me. I don't even know what this vlog is. It's meant to be a weekly vlog. It's not a weekly vlog. So yeah, two events this week on my own. I feel like a proud independent woman. Like I am actually an adult now. I'm 22 on the 3rd of December. That is horrible. But I'm an adult. This is me adulting, drinking wine in my hotel room on my own. Do you know what annoys me? Oh my god. Disclosure, we're on at Park Life when I went. But some girl started on me because I was trying to get out of the, the crowd. We were at Skepta and I, I thought it was Disclosure, it was at the wrong stage. So we were walking through and this girl, I'm not joking, like fully tried to grab me and my mate and was like, what the fuck are you doing? I was like, what? We're trying to get through? She was grabbing like my back, nipping my back, trying to pull me. I'm thinking, just enjoy Skepta. You're at park life, like we're trying to start on people for. So yeah, a little story time there. And so it just put me off completely, like going and seeing Disclosure. I went to the stage and I was like, do you know what? Can we just go please? Because that's put me in a shit mood that I'm not going to enjoy this now. Like really, really put me in a bad mood. So now, every time I listen to Disclosure, I think about that and not being able to see Disclosure. But I just think, why are girls like that? Why are girls actually like that? That's the equivalent of girls in clubs where the barge past you. Proper barge past you. Can't stand that. I always say something like me. Like, I remember this girl was fully barging into me, like barging into me. She was with girls that didn't like me. And I just turned around and said, what the f*** are you doing? Like, why are you barging into me? really annoys me that. I really don't like that. He does my head in. Girls I think they can just do shit like that. I've got some funny stories actually about moments like that. I definitely should tell them. But we'll leave it for another time. I get badged by a lot of girls actually when I think about it. So yeah, don't oh this chair keeps going back scare me. Don't be that girl in a night out, right? Just be a nice fucking girl. It's not that hard, and if you're not a nice girl, just don't come out. People want to enjoy the night, people want to see disclosure, and girls ruin it. Oh. Let me message my boyfriend that's not even my boyfriend. I, I chat to boys, yeah, when I fancy him or whatever. Oh, he's opening it quite quick, what the hell? 
<sighs> Why aren't you typing yet? Oh yeah, there we go. Um, <laughs> so yeah, and I, I made this joke to a lad once, right? And it was literally like a joke, like it was just a joke. And it was not even a bad joke at all. But I always forget that people don't know you like that. Wait, why is he not replying? I do become quite psychotic, as you can probably see. This is the only reason that I need someone with me when I'm away, so that I can get advice on boys, because as you can tell, I'm quite an indecisive person. I always rely on someone else's opinion for something. Like, I need someone else's opinion, and you just can't reply to me right now, so. Oh my God, I should have brought my tarot cards. I've done a reading on him, actually. <laughs> Shut up, Lucy. Every boy that I speak to, I do a reading before, so I know how it's gonna pan out every time it's been player or separation. And they've never ever failed me. Oh my god, I'm gonna be like be the latest person to this event ever. Like it started literally nearly an hour ago. No, that's so bad. What's the hair? Do you know what? I don't mind my hair when I like curl it, but then what do I do with the top bit? Girlies and boys, if you're watching, um, I'm ready. And I'm wearing this dress from White Fox Boutique. And I'm also bringing this little bag with me. Hold on. This is the outfit. I'll show you in the mirror. Literally, this dress is on your favourite dress. I was like, I need to wear this tonight. I feel physically sick because usually I go in events walking in with someone. I'm not really bothered about walking in my own, to be honest, but I don't know why I feel sick. My miss this boy. Um, anyway, <laughs> this is the outfit. I got gold heels on um, and my little white fox dress with my white fox bag. I love it. So yeah, I'm gonna go to the event. Hopefully I'll be able to film some stuff. Um, might end up forgetting, probably won't. I probably will film, but I'm not taking my camera, so I sometimes forget when I do that. But yeah, that is the outfit. I thought I'd just include this in the vlog, because why not? Hi, so it's like a week and a bit later since I filmed. I actually didn't film anything at the event. I got to the event, grabbed a glass of wine, straight down. I think I got another glass of wine and then I got like two double vodkas and then I went out with money, it was really good. And then I had a really, really eventful night. Yeah, that was the vlog. I'm sorry I didn't film anything there. Um, it wasn't actually meant to be like a, well no, it was meant to be a weekly vlog, but I messed it up, didn't I? I'm gonna try and film another weekly vlog this week, but I probably won't be able to. I'm so bad at filming now, like I always forget. I will, I'll try. Um, but yeah, let me know if any other videos you want to see. I don't know why my face looks so swollen on this camera, what the hell. Um, but that is that. And I'll see you on my next video. Au revoir.